I'm Ilona Gmowska from Zawirowania Dance Theater. I would like to uh, invite you to take a part in dance workshop, which is a part of a bigger, a bigger project, um, Polish-Israeli project promoting uh, Stanisław Lem's art. So let's start very easy, connecting to your breathing, your body, yourself. Just stretch body, like in the morning, after waking up, oh, do whatever you need. Hear your breathing, observe it. Do what you want to do. And continuing, let's go down slowly. Feel the floor. Feel the touch of the floor. Okay. And let's put hands on our knees and breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Doing circles with our chest in the front up to the sky. And another way round. Breathe in to the front and breathe out to the back. Okay, and hands on our legs. Breathe in and out. A little bit faster. More dynamic. Breathe in and out. Rolling your pelvis on the floor. Okay, and sides. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Okay, and now twisting. Hands here and breathe in, out, in, out. Quite fast. Hands on your chest, continuing this movement. Hands on shoulders, continuing. And on your head, breathe in and out, in, out. And fingers tips to the sky. And we're going down with our hands the same way. So on our head. Shoulders. Chest. And down. Okay, shaking our wrists and then we close our right leg and open, left leg and open, close and close, knee to the knee and leg, leg, straightening the leg. Be repeating that feeling how our hands are touching the floor. And let's try to find a way to draw a eight, number eight with our head. Breathing freely. Okay, and for a second, let's go down to the floor. We take our legs up and we make a swing left, right, left, right to loosen our hips. <sighs> Smoothly. And feet and head. 
the hand up and we shake, shake, shake. And breathing out, we just drop it. <sighs> Breathe out, 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 out. Okay, we take our knees to the chest and we come up. And I invite you to be on hands and knees. And we take up our wrists, staying with shoulders in a line with our fists, pushing the floor. If it's too much, we can just do one by one to prepare our hands to take a weight of the body. And then we bend and straight. Then straightening, we rotate our uh, we rotate our elbows. Okay, and now let's imagine that we are a cat that wants to move freely. Let's engage the spine, head, shoulder blades, and concentrate on articulation in our wrists, elbows, shoulders, and whole spine. Like we want to move everything, rotate, bend, check the limits of our joints. <laughs> Breathe, push the floor, release. And then the same, but we take our knees from the floor and we are able to move even more bigger, pushing the floor with our legs and hands, stretching the body. Again, we can use this moment to do what we need. And continuing, but left arm is not on the floor and we still want to move our whole body. And we change our hand. And now both hands on the floor, but we take right leg, move around, send, reach, and change legs. Okay, and now we can change legs and arms but let's try to stay maybe even only on two uh, arms on or legs to use different kind of support also stretching through the space breathing and continue but let's go through the space. Use whole, sp whole space. And focus on your eyes. Ask yourself if you see what you're looking at. You can see your body space around you or even far away and let's go up still pushing the floor to go up breathing staying in the this floating movement okay and now I would like you uh, to, I would like to propose you some task. So the task for our improvisation is to move on your breathing in and stop to breathe out. And then again, breathe in, move in and breathe out in a pause. Breathe in and out to really feel that your breathing is leading you, that you don't plan your movement, but you end your movement and start because of your breathing. 
Let's do some improvisation on that. You can isolate the movement on or move whole body while breathing in. Let your breath to lead your movement. Don't predict it. Okay? And let's switch and we make a movement while breathing out. And while breathing in, we stop. And again. And stop to breathe in. Let's go. And let's combine it. So you decide if you move on breathing in or breathe out. You can change while doing that. And please check, observe if really your breathing is leading, that you don't decide to stop. You stop because you change the way of breathing. Okay, let's, let's start. You can find your tempo, you can change it. Let's go. Okay, so we will use this experience uh, to our choreography and now I would like you to teach some of movements. Uh, so imagine that I'm in front of you, there is a front, our front, and let's start with our head going down, left, back, and off balance, we do steps, left, right and slide then we kick and take our body to spin it can be one or two spins so one more time we move into diagonal head down left back off balance left right hand on the floor slide kick take your body close and we go into the floor. Then we take our upper and down body up and again melting down. Again a little bit faster to make a fluent movement. And head around of balance. So we're falling left, right, slight kick and spin. Down melting down okay one more time and we're going further and head falling left right slight kick take your body down up 
and melting down. Left knee is going left, up, and we push our left leg to extend our hand to reach, and then we take our right leg back, and head from right ear to the left ear. Again, so we are here with our body up, down, and left knee, left, up, we pushed left foot, reach our left hand, right leg is going back, head from right to the left knee. And then we push from right leg, we kick our left knee and we pull our right hand to make this spin. We want to stay close to the floor. Okay. And then we send our right leg, like swing up to go down and push from your hands to sit. So again, from here, going up, melting down, left knee, push, reach with your hand, right leg back, ear from right to the left and spin, pelvis up, leg, right leg up, push from your hands and we continue. We slide our, slide our pelvis towards the left foot, it stays here, with stretched right leg. Then we send right leg to the right, uh, uh, right side, push your pelvis up, left hand to the floor, left, left step, right, and we go up again so we are here we slow slide our pelvis send our leg right leg pelvis up left hand to the sky and the floor change legs twist again right leg in the back and then we move from right hand to really reach your chest up and then close. Okay, let's try to do it from the beginning. And head down, around, falling, left, right, slide, kick, spin, down, up, and melting down, left knee, push the floor, reach your left hand, right leg, ears, and spin, then suspend your pelvis up, leg, and go up. Slide your pelvis, leg, pelvis up, left hand, left leg, right leg, right hand, to the sky, and then close. From here, jump to the back, jump again, to reach the sky with your hands and just flip with your leg. Again, so we are up, we close, jump, jump again, reach to the sky, change leg and left, right hand, like elbows to the belly. And from that, we make a turn on our right leg. So, first jump, second, a little bit, small one, leg, left hand, right hand to the turn, and we want to take our head below the hands and go like a wave, and we're melting down. And for now, that's it. Let's combine everything together. From the beginning, head, falling, left, right, hand, slide, and down, up, and melting down, left knee, push, reach, change head, spin, 
Suspend your pelvis leg and push to the floor. Push the floor. Your pelvis up, left hand, left leg, right, right. To the sky and close. First jump, second one, smaller. Lick, left, right hand, turn, wave, and think down. Okay. We will repeat again, and then we will try to put a task on it. Breathe in and out. Feel the touch of the floor. And head. Small left, right, slight kick. Now. Pelvis and push the floor. Slide your pelvis up, hand, leg, leg, and chest to the sky, close. Flick, left, right hand, and wave, and fall down. Okay, let's repeat. We don't need to be together, but let's concentrate on your breathing when you take a breath, when you breathe out, just to see how breathing works with you. Okay, let's go. We don't need to hurry. Take your time. Hope you enjoyed it. And now, quite strange task. So, like while doing improvisation on breathing, we stop whenever our breathing in or out, uh, breathing in or out, that's our decision, starts. So, for example, I have breathing in and stop to breathe out. I fall, breathing in, up and out so like in the end of our improvisation when we could decide if the movement is on our breathing in or out we can change it but we stop for some time during this chore choreography and that would be nice if we try not to separate movement but to stop to stop um, while doing a movement, that that it's quite surprised, uh, surprising. Okay, um, last time, but really take your time and make it your own choreography and dance. Okay.
Okay, so if you'd like to do it again, mm, I fully invite you to do that. And yeah, the idea is to cut movement and to stop in different kind of um, situations, not easy to, hmm, that it's not um, comfortable, I would say. This is not the end of the movement, but somehow in between, like something strange happening with our body. We have this flow, but it stops for some time. Like, uh, yeah, um, some strange change that stop us from the flow of movement, dance and life. So I hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much for being together and dancing together. Bye bye.